It was only a matter of time before Savathun showed herself. She is not capable of letting this moment pass without placing a claw on the scales. For now, she has exactly what she wants. Uncertainty. We will take that from her. Track down her brood, and pull back the veil from her plans. Mara Sav, so eager to spar with gods at the drop of a hat. Aren't you tired of losing to me? I seem to recall your logic rebuked. Your ghost being imprisoned by the vanguard. That tastes of anything but loss. The sword logic was always tarnished. But your bomb logic also went down in flames. Quite spectacularly, if I do say so myself. Two queens. Failed by ideology. We adapt or die. And it's a new age. Isn't that right, your majesty? Dark and light. What trinket from the past holds your attention so? Not a trinket. A perspective. The knowledge of angles, of edges, and the points at which they end. A convincing argument from Sister Superior, you could say.
Guardian. Those taken. I need you to focus your efforts on destroying them and releasing their energy. As much of it as you can. a finger on the scales. The darkness inside of you is surging, like standing on the threshold of being taken. You see how they see. Savathun's plan was never about hiding anything, but revelation. Look for what is out of place, and bend it back. I cannot hold it any longer. I feel the Traveler's pain too, you know. Without me, the Witness would have swept Saul away a long time ago. How noble of you. I am sure your intentions were pure, with no ulterior motive. We play an unwinnable game, meant to extend on forever. And I've shown you how to change the rules time and time again. Without even a thank you. There will be a day when you've run out your usefulness, witch. When you will have no greater scheme to protect you from our wrath. <laughs> 